Hello everyone. Welcome to Aptitude Jab. This is a data table. It says that there are four states in a country A, B, C, and D. And the table gives the number of universities in these states during four different years. The data is collected once in a decade. So the years are 1990, 2000, 2010, and 2020. So once in 10 years, they collect the data, and some information is missing from the table. Okay. What we are given is that all the values are multiples of 5 less than 100. So whatever these values are, are less than 100 and are multiples of 5. The ratio of the number of universities in C in 1990 and 2020 is 2 ratio 3. So this is 2 ratio 3. The number of universities either increased or remained the same over the period of time. So there will no, be no decrease. It can be same. It can increase. There were 230 universities in the country in 1990. So in 1990, there were a total of 230 universities. Okay. So based on this, we have to answer the questions, right? Now, the first question that uh, we could uh, see that what, what value can we find for these, these numbers? So one thing that we are given that these are multiples of 5 less than 100. So this could be 85, 90, 95 less than 100 and it is 2 ratio 3. Okay, so only this satisfies. Right? There is only one possibility that it could be 90. So we are sure about the number of universities that is 90 and 60 here. Okay. And total 230, this is 100, 160. So this is 70. So these three values we can fill from the given statements. Rest of the things we cannot fill because that is the only piece of information that we have about 1990 and the number of universities in C. Okay. So now let us look at the questions. The first question is what is the minimum number of universities in 2000? So for the number of universities to be minimum in 2000, we will assume that this number does not increase, right? It is given that the number of universities either increased or remained same. So if we have to find minimum, we will assume that the number remains same. So it will be 70 and this will be 60. Okay, so we get uh, 120, uh, 200, 260. So the answer is 260. If there was an increase of 20 universities in 2020 over 2010, what is the maximum number of universities in 2010? Again, that's an, <clears throat> that's an easy question. So what we have to do is we have to find the maximum number of universities in 2010, right? If we have this, we are given that, let us say the total number of universities in 2010 is N, okay? And we are given that in 2020, the number becomes N plus 20, okay? We have to find the value, maximum value of N, so that means we, sh we should find the maximum value of n plus 20. Now what can be the maximum value of n plus 20? So maximum we can have in A is a 95 because uh, it has to be less than 100 and a multiple of 5. So we get 345. Okay, if we add this, 275, 345, right? So if this is 345, we will have 325 here. We do not have to find individually, right? It is saying that total increase by 20. Okay, so we can have 15 plus 5, 20 increase. So we will have these same numbers here. Okay, so that is 325. Next question. If at least 10 universities were added in state A in every decade, which of the following cannot be the total maximum number of universities in? Uh, so remove this word maximum, the total number of universities in 2010. Okay, so we are given that 10 universities were added at least 10 universities, right? So that could be more than 10 also, but minimum 10. So we have to find which of the following cannot be the number of universities in 2010, right? So we will look for the extreme values, right? So in such questions, we look for the extreme values and see that which are the possibilities, okay? So if we see the minimum, if we talk about the minimum in 2010, that would be 60 because increase of 10 is required, 60, 75, 85 and if we consider minimum here is 60, okay, 120 plus 1, 
160 that is 280 so minimum there will be 280 universities right if we talk about the maximum in 2020 2010 sorry so this can be maximum 95 isn't it in the previous question we said this can be maximum 95 so this can be maximum 85 because there has to be an increase of at least 10 so maximum we will get 85 plus 75 plus 85 and what can be this maximum value this maximum can be 70 because it can remain same we are just given about this state a okay we, we are not given about d so we can have maximum 70 here okay 160 uh, 230, 315. So the number of universities will lie between 230, 218 and 315, right? So the the number 320 is not possible. So it is 280 is possible, 295 is possible, 315 is also possible, 320 is not possible. Okay. Next question: Which of the following cannot be the ratio of number of universities in 2000 and 2020? Okay, so what we will do is we will find the minimum and maximum in 2010 uh, <coughs> and 2020 and find the values. Okay, so if we talk about 2010, sorry, 2000 and 2020, minimum and maximum. So minimum we said that 260 and what can be the maximum? We can have maximum of this as 75 and maximum this can be 70. Okay, so that is uh, 275. Okay, and uh, if you talk about 2020, 2020 the maximum is 345. And the minimum, if we talk about the minimum of 2020, that will be, see this 90 is fixed. So if we take the minimum, that is 50. Let us assume that this number does not increase. Remember, this is an additional condition only for this question. Okay, so that is not given in the main conditions. So we get uh, 300. Okay, so that is 300 to 345. Now let us find that how can these ratios happen? right so can we have these ratios uh, formed so 3 ratio 4 so if we take the multiple of 3 in this range that is 270 isn't it 270 and if we take the ratio 4 correspondingly we should get 270 and 360 that is not possible right so that is the answer so let us check other options 4 ratio 5 so multiple of 4 is 260 then corresponding we get 325 Okay, that is possible. Okay, 5 ratio 6. 5 ratio 6 means that this should be a multiple of 25 because then only you will get a multiple of 5 here. So, if you take 275, we get 330. So, 5 ratio 6 is also possible. Okay, 6 ratio 7. Multiple of 6 here is 270 and 45 into 7 that is 315. So, that is also possible. Okay, so this is also possible. 3 ratio 4 is not a possible ratio in this given range. So that is the solution to the set and answers to the questions.